Welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here you are welcome today we are doing something we've not done in a while which I love to do of course we are doing a restaurant review so I went to this place called 343 North and it is in Victoria Island the interesting thing about the location of this restaurant is it is just beside a supermarket that I go to all the time and I just never thought to look into what this restaurant was about but I was so pleased that I went there because my experience was awesome. The restaurant is really pretty, very colorful, very welcoming and immediately I got in I was like wow okay. I had no expectations, I was just looking for a restaurant to have like my birthday <laughs> lunch <laughs> and I wanted somewhere that had Indian cuisine, I wanted some naan bread so I just went online and I found them. I didn't even know anything about them so when I entered I was pleasantly surprised because it was really gorgeous. They have the general sitting area which was where we sat and then they have this private dining space for intimate um, occasions let's say you have your birthday or something dinner with friends or with your colleagues they had this beautiful space so I thought that was really cool and I also thought about how they incorporated the design on the air conditioners as well We went there on a Wednesday and they have a set menu called Pasta Wednesdays. You can choose from other options on their menu, but they have this option for you for everything, I think, uh, 7,000 Naira. So you can have one starter, one main, and a glass of wine for that cost. Which I think is really cool, considering that a lot of restaurants in Lagos are so expensive. If you were going on a date, it would be affordable. You and your date spend 14k in total, and you have starter and you have a main. My husband went with the option of the set menu, but I went with the option of like choosing whatever I wanted because remember, I came here because of naan bread, <laughs> butter chicken, that kind of thing. So that was what I really, really wanted. And then we placed our order. I have to say that the waitress was really, really nice and her service was awesome. She made us feel very, very comfortable. Her name is Barbara and I recommend her service like she was awesome. For the drink, I think this was a pina colada and I enjoyed it so much because it was frozen and it took the whole dinner for it to melt. So I really, really liked it. This was the starter that came with the pasta option. I wasn't really feeling it, but the starter that I ordered for separately, <laughs> which was this one, I think is the dynamite shrimp, and then their spring roll and samosa, you guys. It was amazeballs. This shrimp in the cocktail, <laughs> in the cocktail cup was really good. And especially this samosa, it was too good. I'm definitely going back to this restaurant. I 
think what I take away from my experience from this restaurant is that they made us feel comfortable. When we got there, it was a bit early. We got there about 11 something in the morning and that's because we just finished school runs in the morning and we wanted to quickly have lunch before going for pickup. So we had such a short time to visit and they only open from 12. If it was other restaurants, they would have told us, oh, go and wait in your car or wait outside or come back later. They don't care what you're doing, but they allowed us to enter and they made us feel comfortable. And like I said, the waitress was really nice. They allowed us to take pictures. Lately, a lot of restaurants, they don't like pictures or videos or cameras. So I really appreciated that. For my main, I ordered the Kadai chicken. I went with my gut, with my feeling, and it is the boneless piece of chicken cooked in coarsely ground spices. It was the exact taste I was looking for because I had it once at another Indian restaurant and I used to buy it all the time. So when I came here, I was describing it and I was like, this, this is what I want. And immediately I tasted it, I was like, wow, this is what I've been looking for. And I had it with cheesy naan bread. It was so, so good, you guys. It was 5,000 naira for the kadai sauce and then 1,000 naira for this cheesy naan and I thought the price was really good. My husband got the pasta option and he thought it was okay. This restaurant is like a fusion restaurant because they do mainly Indian but they also have like Nigerian cuisine and they do a bit of like Chinese or Asian cuisine so if you don't want Indian you can try their Nigerian options but I really really loved what I had on this day and I can't wait to go back especially <laughs> especially since it's beside one of my favorite supermarkets I could not hold myself you guys see how I stain myself am I the only person that must stain herself anytime she's eating in public if I've not stained myself I've not finished eating <laughs> I had to do a doggy bag because I couldn't finish the naan bread. The starter was already so filling, so I took that home. And my final review of this place would be that, first of all, I will come back. <laughs> I've added it to my list of favorite restaurants in Lagos because it is affordable, the location is good for me, and I like the kind of food they cook. It is delicious. So that is why I'm coming back. I hope you guys try out this restaurant. Let me know what your experience is like. And if you want more restaurant reviews, let me know in the comment section. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!